We are entering May after seeing below average rainfall for April. I know it's hard to believe with how many rainy gray days we had. Exactly. And since we're surrounded by big rivers, flooding is usually top of mind. And when we see rain persistently, especially now scientists have found a troubling trend with rainfall and flooding. Here's News 4's meteorologist Leah Hill. Flooding along rivers or in towns, it can happen on several timescales in a couple of days over prolonged rainfall events or during quick, heavy bursts of rainfall. And it's those heavy bursts of high intensity rain that was the subject of a most recent study. Rain is a good thing when it waters the plants, reduces droughts and replenishes drinking water. Too much water can cause flooding. And what happens is the ground gets so saturated with water that it just can't absorb anymore. Other than heat, flooding is the leading cause of water related deaths and is responsible for billions of dollars in damages yearly. In a new study, scientists from Climate Central focused in on one of the causes of floods. So we looked at hourly rainfall and to see if hourly rainfall was higher than it was before. As temperatures rise, so does the air's capacity to hold water. When there's more water in the atmosphere, more rain can fall. 150 cities were analyzed. 135 saw an increase in hourly rainfall rates. St. Louis's hourly rainfall intensity is up 20% from 1970. Because these heavy rains are going to cause more of this quick flash flooding. The St. Louis rainfall rate is one concern. The other is increased rainfall rates from cities upstream. You can't just solve the problem for St. Louis. You have to solve the problem of the water that's coming in, too. Protecting wetlands, engineering buildings that can withstand flooding, and flood insurance are just a few ways to prepare. When the waters rise, remember this. Don't ever go into any kind of standing water. Don't drive into it. Don't walk into it. Leah Hill, News 4. Certainly good advice there. We say it all the time. Anytime there's heavy rain, flooding is usually possible, but not too heavy right, right. now. And I don't expect flooding.